It's time again that the children have become restless and excited. The people wait for a man bearing gifts to come be a chimney in this spirit. The man brings his wife and fellow companion bearing gifts in to destroy non-believers. What's up guys? <laughs> We're Game 9 here. Here's a let's play of Final Fantasy Christmas. Uh, this was a, a, a hack I found of Final Fantasy 1. So you might see some Final Fantasy 1 lingo or dialogue, but it's mostly focused on Christmas. So uh, let's just uh, start here. New game, we got Santa, the Elf, Rudolph, Grassy, Mrs. C. And of course, an angel. Uh, it's hard to tell who's who, but you can tell they're food again. Uh, which one's called Santa Bat? I believe, yeah, Bat. It was no Bat. That's a good name for, for Santa, Bat. Let's call him Bat. And, uh, yeah, we'll have, a uh, we'll have, a uh, Frosty. We'll give him Stev. Or, well, see, I wanted to say Steve. Well, we'll just go ahead and say Stev. I think this is a four letter. You can only do four letters. We'll do it, Stab. Stab the snowman. And then, uh, we won't do real. We'll do, uh, let's do Mrs. C. Wait, yeah, let's do Mrs. C. Let's do, where's Mrs. C? Where's Mrs. C? Okay, let's give her a uh, cram. Let's call her cram. Just cause it rolls right off the tongue. Cram. And, uh, yeah, so let's do cram. And, uh, Let's see what happens there. I, I want to say, uh, uh, I forgot what I want to call her, but Cram is good. Then we'll go with, uh, Elf. I think, how's Bud sound? Not because of Buddy the Elf, if anybody's been off that. Uh, I just want to call him Bud. I thought that was always a funny name for an Elf. And here we go! Okay, we start out, we're gonna buy some supplies here. And, uh, yeah, here we go. Uh, like I said, plays just like Final Fantasy 1. That's uh, just a direct hack of the game, but just the guy put in Christmas sprites. It's of the original characters. But, uh, yeah, now buy your, now buy your holiday, uh, you know, poster people, uh, weapons. Cause they need weapons. Uh, you know, this game, I remember playing the, the original Final Fantasy. Back on NES, which this is on the NES. As well, it's a hat, you know, but it was a AES hat, and uh, it was fun. Uh, the original game was fun through Pop Fantasy. Uh, I did beat it a long time ago. Gosh, probably back in 90, 94, 95, somewhere around there, I beat the first one. But uh, I know that's not when it first came out, but you know, I'm only 20, uh, oh, I don't remember how old I am. Anymore. <laughs> I'm getting too old. Anyway, so we're gonna play some of this. We're gonna give them a small hammer, a wooden, whatever, and a rapier sword. Uh, whatever you, you want with that. That's the best options. You know, it was really limited on what you could buy this game, on what you could buy weapon wise and armor wise. But, uh, yeah, so here we go. We're gonna, gonna equip. Uh, all the, make sure everybody's got the right weapon here. Bap and stab and cram and, uh, bud. I just wanted to name them that, that was funny. Uh, let's see, and then get them all chain metal. Yeah, metal! But, uh, yeah, so get them all chain metal and everything. But thanks for watching my Let's Play, guys. Um, uh, <laughs> Uh, it's one of my first, and uh, it, not, I don't know, it, it depends on how well this video does, if I keep doing it. Um, that's up to y'all. If I get at least five views off this, I'll be stoked, and, um, I'll definitely do more. But, uh, that's up to y'all. If you guys want to, I don't really care. I'm just throwing it out there, see if anyone will watch this. Because most of my videos don't get that many views, unless they're off a popular topic. Such as, uh, 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 Powerpuff Girls that I did recently. That was off of a certain topic. 
and everything, and uh, that was great and nice. See, it's the same enemies as one, so I don't have to do anything different except attack, and uh, yeah, cram take some damage there. But uh, yeah, I mean, I'm open to suggestions if you guys have any. Uh, I do, uh, just to let y'all know, I do PS4, uh, PS3, Xbox 360, PS2, Nintendo 64, um, GameCube, and, uh, SNES, NES, GBA, GBC, TV, and uh, almost every, all those systems I can do a game for if you guys have a game in mind. I'm um, up for suggestions on games, uh, I'll review it, and then I'll do it if I like it. Um, or even if I don't like it, I'll still do it. I, I, even games that I hate, I'll play, because it, it's for y'all. I'm not doing this for me. I'm doing this for y'all, and I don't even get paid. Um, I'm one of those people that are not monetized on YouTube. So I'm doing this all for free, y'all. Um, this is just a hobby, really. Um, I'm doing this in my spare time. I enjoy it. I enjoy seeing the views and the comments that I get on these videos. So, uh, yeah, I, I enjoy it a lot. And I appreciate all, by the way, all the support you guys have given my channel the, the, the year, almost a year, I think. I mean, it is a year now uh, that I've been with YouTube. Um, but I just enjoy all that I see from y'all and everything. Let's be know that you guys actually care about what I'm doing. You know, so the comments not, might not be uh, appropriate and nice or whatever, but that's okay. I understand. I don't understand. Uh, and they, for that Fallout 4 video I did with the Automatron DLC, hidden location found. I'm sorry about that. I did not know there was a location already in the game at the when it launched. I just I saw some people on PSN saying it wasn't, and they were from different countries, so I thought it was from that, and uh, I thought that was something new, so that's why I posted it. I posted a new video called Kiri's Legs, if you want to check that out, it's pretty, that was truthful, <laughs> uh, but I did not know at the time I made that video that I could, you could actually turn her into a synth, a synth. Uh, I did not know that. Anyway, so let's uh, do one more battle here. And then we'll get to, uh, the main boss of this game, Garland, who they actually, which is kind of funny that he's the boss of this one, because if you get it, it's Christmas, and you're Santa, a snowman, Mrs. Santa, and an elf. And it's kind of funny that you gotta fight someone named Garland uh, as the boss. <laughs> you know, this is just ironic, ain't it? I didn't know Santa hated, uh, hated Garland so much that he had to fight him at Christmas time. But they, they, they could have done so much more with this instead of just characters. They could at least have some snow or, you know, other stuff happening. Uh, you use like a, a shovel of a snow to for an attack or whatever. But, uh, so here we go with Garland. Santa, wow! Why didn't you give me a Power Ranger when I was little? Take this! Sorry if I read that too fast. Yeah, Garland, number, he was the very first boss ever in Final Fantasy history. Of course he is, because he's the first one. But, uh, he was also probably the... I mean, he was an O... He was a, I think he's only one of... I can't remember if he had a... I can't remember if he had an alter... Uh, boss or not. Like, I can't remember if, like, after you defeat him, does he become something else? Um, Etch Death, I know, was in 4, uh, because I, I didn't play 2 or 3. I played the alternate 2 and 3, which was 4 and 6. But I never played uh, the actual 2 and 3. Um, 4 was really well done. Uh, 4 was awesome. But if I had to make this one, this first Final Fantasy, it was okay. It was great because it started the whole series. This is the one that started it all, which is neat. Uh, that's what's, uh, that's probably the only thing to do about this one. It started the whole franchise and everything. It started the turn-based RPG, which I don't think they had until this one. 
came out. I don't think that was even heard of. But, um, yeah, so this video is, uh, for all those Final Fantasy fans out there that just want some Christmas cheer in their life, I sure want you to be happy! Anyway, but, uh, yeah, so like I was saying, uh, Garland, not, not getting a Power Ranger, you know, that was kind of a, I said they changed some dialogue. And there he goes, he's dead. And, uh, what do they say, Monsters Paris? Who knows, just one. They, they, uh, didn't fit that typo or that noun. Uh, right, they need to work on their grammar a little bit, I guess. Everybody levels up like normal. Baps, Stev, Cram, and Bud. They all level up. Level 2. And, uh, I know I posted this by itself on my channel, no one really watched it. And I know I died <laughs> at Garland that time, but this time I thought, well, I need weapons and stuff, and that's why I came prepared um, on this video. <laughs> so, uh, you know to level up here and divide, divide the loot that we get. Uh, if there's not really that much of loot, it's the spirits and money in all these games. And, um... Yeah, aside from Final Fantasy 15 and 7, 7's remake is gonna be awesome. Can't wait. Let's see what the princess has to say. So you are Santa! Oh! Wow, that was. Great dialogue! You save the princess as a gift to you, I will build a bridge. Go now and make all the non believers pay! Okay. Well, that's typical dialogue for you on the Final Fantasy game. Well, back then it was. Uh, they really didn't well, focus on that as much as they should have. Here we go, though. Well, we're gonna leave the castle. We're gonna go out here. Let's cross the bridge, and here's where the intro came in. This is what got everybody into Final Fantasy. And so the journey begins. What awaits the four? Do they know? Each holding an ore that two thousand years ago shined with beauty from within, but now only darkness. Come, start your journey. Return the light of peace to our world. Program by Miss Here. I think I said that right. Character design by Yoshi Tama Amano. Scenario by Kenji Tarada. 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 Little Kenji. Production of Square 18. Now, I guess that was what the hats called this. I don't know if Square 18 was what they were called back then. I know it was called Square, but I don't know about that. Paul Bessie. That's it. Bye!